What's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Lana Marie here. Today for you I'm bringing you a what's in my bag video. I absolutely love doing these videos. This will actually be my third what's in my purse video. I'm obsessed with organizing. You guys know that. And oh, last week I showed you, okay, of these pouches and you were like, girl, you better show me what's inside of those. <laughs> so that's what I'm here today to do is show you guys what's inside of those pouches, how I organize. I feel like it's really important for me how I put things inside my bag so it's more accessible. So hopefully you guys will find some tips and tricks. But if you're new here, welcome you guys. I will always leave everything that's inside my bag down below so you guys can find it if you're interested in it. And if you feel like depositing some positive energy, give your girl a thumbs up. I'd so appreciate it. I love getting to know you guys, so definitely come say hello in the comments. Even just one little emoji means the world to me. And if you want to stalk me on a more daily basis you can come meet me on instagram i always answer my dms as best as i can over there so i'd love to get to know you over there as well now question of the day is what is your number one item that you absolutely have to have inside your bag let me know i would love to hear it because mine is floss i have to have floss on me if i don't have floss I just feel like, what is the point of carrying a purse? <laughs> Anyways, I hate having stuff in my teeth. You might know that about me if you've been here a while, but if you're new, welcome, like I said, you guys. I'm so excited. I am on the road right now. It has been absolutely insane. My RV, I'm a full-time RVer, and basically, we're in an Airbnb right now. I'm sweating, okay? It's like 80 degrees inside, so please don't mind the frizzy hair. I'm, I'm doing my best here, and the backdrop looks kind of creepy. Okay, I know, I know it is not my normal backdrops, but that's okay, I'm just like, you know what? They already said, they're like, I just want you to get that info out there. So that's what I'm doing for you guys today is making sure that I just get the content to you guys. So I'm in Mammoth. I will try to insert some footage. We've been on a crazy adventure. It's been so much fun. Um, maybe I'll insert some footage at the end of the video if you guys want to see um, an updated of like some of the places we've been. Like I said, if you follow me on Instagram, you would have seen some of these places. So anyways, without further ado, let's hop into that video. The first thing that I want to show you guys is my wallet. So I'm not going to open this all up. We're we're gonna get like an aerial shot of everything in just a second but I just have my wallet these are both authentic Louis Vuitton I'll try to link this down below but I love how small and sleek it is I can fit more stuff in here <laughs> and be more prepared so I can just slide my wallet a few cards and I really really like it so that's the first thing that I wanted to show you guys okay you guys so here is the bag that I am currently using you guys have seen this before I have this in my Disney video you just saw it in my last one I'll link all those videos for you guys down below so you can check them out but I had a question last time and somebody asked me, how can you use your pepper spray if it's inside your bag? Well, I was just showing it to you guys. The whistle and the light actually go on the outside of my bag. This looks really nerdy to me, but I honestly don't care. If I'm by myself at a grocery store or something and I feel like it's a sketchy area, please believe your girl is gonna get out all the things she needs to feel more comfortable. So um, I actually really love this keychain. This I got this in a set from Amazon, it's gold. It really matches the purse well. This is an authentic Louis Vuitton bag. I will link um, some maybe used bags of the same one down below for you guys if you wanna check it out. But the reason why I use this bag is because we've been doing a lot of hiking and day trips and all that, and I have a lot to carry on me. I guess you could say that I carry more now than I normally carry, but I'm totally fine with that. We have all the necessities for safety, which is so much more important to me. So I always like to show you guys my organization. That's really important to me. I'll show you a little bit more of the organization after I take these two out. You guys have seen these a million times. I do not leave the house without having an external charger. I mean, obviously social media is my job, but I just, I think it's important to have a charger on you. This one plugs into a cord that plugs into a USB. And then this one here plugs into the wall with a plug, which I love it. So always carry one of those on me. So I kind of just folded this down so you guys can see. I always divide everything up like file folders because I want to be able to look down inside my bag and to see everything. Now, as you guys know, I'm on the road, so things are constantly changing right now. I'm like, oh, I'm missing this, I'm missing that. I'm like, you know what? It's okay. They say they just want content, so that's what I'm doing here for you guys today. So like I said, this is my EDC bag. Teaser peek and show you guys all of the craziness I have in here. So like I said, check out the video link down below. 
So as you can see, that bag went here. I personally, whenever I see these videos, I don't really like that they just hold it up and show me. So if I had to pick one, I was like, okay, do I wanna show them inside the bag or do I wanna be holding the product and showing it to them? And I was like, for sure, inside the bag because I love organization. I think it's so important and hopefully you guys can get some tips. But that bag goes back here and these two larger ones go up front. Now it's nice because there's this gap on the side where I can put my smaller little pouches right here. And it makes it so nice and easy to grab everything out. All right, so the next bag we're gonna take out is this one here. I also showed you guys a bag that goes inside of my day bag. Even though this is a medium-sized backpack, I have an, a large backpack that I use for my day bag. So if you guys wanna see that bag, let me know, I can show you that as well. But um, this goes inside my day bag usually because it's medication. So I do like to have this on me, like if I'm going somewhere and we're gonna be gone all day, but obviously if I'm going to Target or something and it just, I don't need, need it for those moments. There's certain times that I take this with me. So I'm gonna pull everything out and show you what's inside. Sorry for the backdrop, I told you guys, this is a table at the Airbnb we're at. So this is what this will have to do for now. I always have electrolytes, vitamin C packs, and then I have NyQuil, and then I have some contacts. And this is what I'm really excited to show you guys. This is a thing that I was actually really excited to show you guys. I got this container from the dollar store. Yes, the dollar store. And it has held up really well. I've never had it pop open on me. Um, that was one of the concerns that I had. I labeled everything. If you guys saw my excursion bag, my travel bag video, I have something similar to this, but this is so much better for your purse or for a bag that's smaller. Oh, you know what? I did show this to you guys on my 72 hour bug out bag. So I have made them for every single bag that I have. I just like having medication on me. I feel it's so important. And you can flip it over and I have the amounts on it. And if the amount is not on there, it's two. So I left those blank. So anyways, love this little guy. So convenient. All right, so next up we have this front guy here. I'm gonna go through everything in the bag. You know what, I forgot, this thing goes inside of my EDC bag. So I'm gonna stick that in there right now, but this is just a carabiner. And I always have one of these on me. You can hook your backpack to um, the back seat of a car. You can do all kinds of stuff with it. There's so many things I've used this for. So this bag is like my hygiene, beauty bag, all that good stuff. Everything goes inside of here. Love having it all in one little pouch. Love these pouches, you guys. It's a great Amazon find. I will definitely be linking these bags down for you um, down below. They have small, medium, and large. This is the smallest size. Okay, the first three things are lip products. Love this. Then I have these two Stila liquid lips. You guys know I'm obsessed with Stila liquid lip. These are my favorite. Let's tell you what. This is Patina and Patina Shimmer. So next up I have floss and I have wisp, which are great for oral hygiene so you can brush your teeth and floss on the go. I have to have floss. That is like one of my top items. Okay, so next up I have a little mini toothbrush and a tiny little Colgate toothpaste. Now I got this from a hotel. I tried to look it up for you guys on Amazon. I saw one, it's not the same brand, so I'll link that one for you guys, but they don't have this size. It's a 10 gram if you're looking it up. I even looked on the internet for you. Sorry, you have to get this when you're at a hotel. So when you're there, stock up, you'll feel like you hit the jackpot. Okay, so next up I just have these two brushes. One is for under my eyes and one is for blending eyeshadow. I just like having just these two brushes on me. I normally have a little powder on me, but it fell out of my bag. Okay, next up is this little gold bottle. It comes off like this and I'll open this up. Oh. Interesting. So it's all used up, but I normally put in a setting spray in here um, that has SPF in it. I don't remember the name. I'll try to link it down below for you guys if I can find it. I actually moved this little tweezer set from my EDC and I put it in here instead. I thought it would be better with my like hygiene stuff. So I did put my little tweezers in here. Next up, I always have my straw on me. I feel like it's so important to have your straw on you so you don't get stuck with one of those nasty paper straws. Ooh, I cannot do it, okay? Like those paper straws are 
gross. <laughs> so anyways, love having this, super handy. So next up, I use Neutrogena wipes. I just love having these little miniature ones on me. Okay, then I have a little nail clipper, and then I have a clear eyes. I wear contacts, I don't know if you know that, but like having this on me. Next two items are additions you guys have not seen in my other bags. So this top one here, these are actually seat covers which I love having these on me, especially now that I'm going to like national park bathrooms and different things like that and you have little kids. I feel like it's so important to have these. They never have these in those places. Last thing is this moleskin padding. I'm pretty sure you can get this at the dollar store as well. I love having this and I have a little pair of scissors in my EDC bag. I just cut it up and put a piece if like my shoes rubbing weird or the kids shoes rubbing weird, it always happens. And this is just so convenient to have. So next up we have this side here and I'm gonna just start pulling things out. Now you guys have seen this bag before multiple times. It just has my techie stuff in it. So I'm gonna go through this pretty fast. This is just comes from an old Louis Vuitton wallet. It is authentic and it came, it's like an insert with another wallet, but I don't use the wallet. So anyways, this is headphone adapters. This is an adapter for your cell phone to the computer. This is an adapter for HDMI. This is for an SD card to your phone. And then I also have this so you can take selfies. This is a little, it hooks up to Bluetooth and you can take selfie pictures. All right, so next up we have this drink pouch. Um, it's got so many different types of drink type of things. I also bring snacks with me wherever I go, but that usually goes into the kids bag. I will stick like a bar or something in the top of my bag if I need it for myself. But the most important thing for me to have on me is stevia and tea <laughs> and you guys saw i had tylenol on the other back but i also stick it here i'll just show you guys these things individually this is the sweet leaf this is stevia tea's in here husband he needs coffee like a crackhead needs crack caffeine makes me feel like a crackhead which i cannot handle my heart starts like palpitating anyways i normally have um crystal light packs but these are the ones i have in here right now and i love doing this like if we go to a restaurant and my kids really want something sweet but i don't want them to have soda or something i'll just give them one of those this is liquid iv this is actually my favorite electrolyte mix i like this flavor better i just there's every i just love it if you have a hangover or if you drink it the night before a hangover it also helps or the day after okay so i'm gonna stick this back in there then um i just had this like kind of wedged in right here like that even though it doesn't go all the way to the bottom this is an authentic louis vuitton um thing i think it was for some kind of cord but i just stick my little headphones in here you guys know i love these they have a cord but they don't need to be hooked up to your phone so i'll stick those right there and then my last little pouch Let's take that out. This is first aid. That was all medication. This one has like bandages and stuff like that. Also, I totally forgot to show you guys this case. I was refilling it, so it was out. Um, but I also have it out all the time. I haven't gone anywhere. It has my enzymes and my probiotics that I like to take with every meal. So I know you guys have seen my pill case. That has all of my vitamins that I take like once a day. So this has something that I need to take with every meal. So I just stick them in here. I put two in each one, and then I just keep refilling it. So what next up is this holographic, holographic little pouch here. Love this little guy. I love things that are like flat little pouches. That's my favorite if you guys see a theme here. They're so much easier to slide in and they don't get as bulky and I feel like you can just organize so much better. Okay, so here is what is in this little pouch here. Um, we're gonna start with this, it's powder. It used to be Tums. I just put it in a little Ziploc bag and now they are mushed, which is fine. Honestly, I'll still take it. I'm gonna get the chewable kind next time so they won't. that won't happen, but you know if you've had heartburn, if it's an emergency, you're gonna take the powder. <laughs> and then I have um, some of these alcohol prep pads, which are great for cleaning your phone off. Your kids get a boo-boo. They're not gonna like the way it feels, but, and I have a little tiny thing of Neosporin, which goes right there, but I don't know where it's at. So I'm gonna have to replace that or pull it out of another kit. I have so many different little kits. Then we have Band-Aids. You cannot live without Band-Aids. So if you get a kid, I have two boys, and if they split something open, 
This actually is, I think it's called a butterfly bandage, okay? You basically put it on one side of the cut, let's just say the cut is right here, and then you pull and then you put the other side down so that way it kind of keeps it closed. And these work really, really well. I have Tylenol in the bottle and an, ex an extra little set. Then I have NyQuil and DayQuil. So if I don't put the medicine bag in here, I'll still have NyQuil and DayQuil, I'll still have Tylenol. That's why you wanna have like repetition in all of the things that you have. So if you're missing a bag for some reason or you leave one out, you still have the things that are vital for you to have on you. And medication's really important for me to have, you know, this type of medication. And then if you're going somewhere longer, you can bring the bigger bag with more medication. And then I just have some Alka-Seltzer. All right, you guys, so that is everything that I keep inside of my purse currently. All right, you guys, I hope you enjoyed what's inside my purse video. I had so much fun making this for you. You know it incorporates all my favorite things, organization and being prepared. Being prepared is like number one for me, okay? So I had so much fun doing this for you guys. If you have not done so yet, subscribe, hit that little bell. Let's do a money symbol. If you guys have made it all the way this far, thank you so much. It truly means the world to me when you watch my video all the way through. Leave me a money symbol and let me know Know that you did. Thank you guys again so much for watching, and until next time, I'm always your girl, Lana Marie. Help me echoes, secrets that we know, doors that open for us in a moment. Turning on, keeping